What is a criminal statute of limitation in Oklahoma? I'm Tulsa Attorney James Worth, and that is the question that we have, a statute of limitation for criminal cases. And that sets up essentially a deadline for a criminal case to be prosecuted. And if prosecutors or the state of Oklahoma, if they wait too long to charge a crime, then it can be dismissed for being outside of that statute of limitations. And the idea is to have finality here so that if a crime is committed and a certain amount of time goes by, they can't charge you with that 50 years later, 100 years later, that once the statute statute of limitations is expired, they can no longer go after that criminal prosecution. Now, how long is the statute of limitations on various crimes? That I'm going to cover in a different uh, video that it's going to come after this one. And also there's other things that kind of set timelines for when things must move forward in a criminal case, such as your right to speedy trial. And I'm going to cover videos on um, after this one. But as far as statute of limitations, that is the amount of time that the state has um, or the county district attorney or the municipal prosecutor to file charges against somebody uh, before it is too late to do so. And most of the time, the statute of limitation begins to run from the time the crime occurred. But for certain statute of limitations, it's based on uh, the time runs from when um, an awareness of the crime occurs. So there could be a lot of different facets to it. If you're dealing with something um, as such as an investigation for a criminal charge or have questions regarding statute of limitations as it relates to something specific to you, you're going to want to talk to an attorney privately and confidentially to get legal advice to get that scheduled with somebody in my office and go online to makelaweasy.com.